Hey everyone, it's your boy KP here. Hope everything is all right. Hope you're staying safe out there. Just wanted to highlight a story coming out of um, Nairobi, Kenya. A lot of times when we hear of stories coming out of Africa, it's, um, you know, we think of something bad, you know, presidents are not leaving power, there's a coup, um, warlords are taking over the place, people are starving, you know, they show the commercials with that special song and flies just attacking the face of um, some people with uh, their bones sticking out. Well, um, you know, of course, with the emergence of the internet and social media, we're learning a lot more about the continent and how progressive and um, how innovative that place is. Uh, the highlight for today or for this post is um, Zambi Mate. Zambi Mate, she, long and short of it is that she created uh, bricks made out of plastic, out of recycled material. That's what she did. Um, she she said that she noticed it was being done around, um, you know, in different countries or in other parts of the world. And she wanted to see, she took the challenge on, basically said, wanted to see what she could do. She didn't want to lean on the government. A lot of times they look at, look to the government to do this and to do that. It doesn't happen or it takes a long time to happen. And um, so she said, you know what, let me be a change agent and let me try and make it so durable, very durable in terms of the um, the video that I was watching. She threw it on the ground and she said, it's, you know, very strong and it's light, it's strong and light to two to, to very good components when it comes to um, uh, designing and creating bricks, but made out of plastic. All right. So shout outs to Zambi and um, shout outs to the team of individuals that she's working with to bring something like this to the market. And I hope it goes somewhere. You know, usually when you get these inventions, you know, something so revolutionary and so incredible, what happens is that, um, you know, the information is suppressed and uh, you don't get uh, the opportunity to see it, um, whether it's at all or for years. Well, shout outs to her for doing something now. All right, take care of yourself. Until next time, man, it's your boy KP. Stay woke and stay red.